My favorite furniture makers are all dead guys from early New England. And uh, one of them is a man named William Savile, who lived in Braintree, Massachusetts from 16, uh, 1640 to 1670, made oak furniture. It's some of the first stuff I ever studied in a museum to try to learn how it was made. <laughs> These are hard questions. So my favorite piece of someone else's furniture, uh, well, there's all that historic stuff that I study. I always uh, enjoy those a lot. Uh, but, you know, you, today I'm going to say it's this new chair Curtis Buchanan is making. I sat in it and I was just in love with it. And it's also a very simple yet beautiful chair. Uh, my favorite piece of furniture that I have made, uh, it changes from time to time, and usually it's the one that's almost done on my bench. And then once it's done, I don't like it so much anymore, and I'm on to the next one. Uh, all right. So the first thing I ever made that I was proud of, the first thing I ever really, you know, felt, wow, that, that done it there. Uh, I can't remember what the, f what the very first one was, but this year I'm focused on the year 1978. And I remember reading John Alexander's book, Make a Chair from a Tree, and making the chairs from that, uh, from that book and really feeling like I had accomplished something. How much furniture in my house did I make? A staggering amount. Uh, I, I've tried to count it a number of times, and, uh, and we live in a small house. Uh, easily 30 pieces or more. <laughs> the one tool I wouldn't want to live without is my German hewing hatchet. Uh, the, single bevel hatchet that I use for roughing out all of my oak boards for joinery. That's the one I grab if the shop's on fire. If you could only work in one species of wood, <laughs> uh, One species of wood, no, no question about it, it's oak. And uh, for me, it's usually red oak, but I'll use white oak too. Uh, I'd rather carve white oak, I'd rather plain red oak. Can I do that one? Can I add to that one? Sure. Uh, uh, so ask me the question again. If you could only work one piece, of, one species of wood, what would it be? I, I only do work one species of wood and it's oak. <laughs> hey YouTube, if you liked that video, click the thumbs up button. If you really like that video, click subscribe. And if you really, really like that video, head on over to findwoodworking.com where you're gonna get over 40 years of the world's best woodworking tips, tricks, and projects. FindWoodworking.com members get full access to the website. That's over 50 of our long form video workshop series and hundreds of articles from the pages of Fine Woodworking Magazine. Head on over and check it out today.